Hello Scorpio and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of May 27th through June 2nd. Ooh. For some of you, there could be somebody coming back, something that you've been um, doubting. Maybe not this week, but later for others, it's almost changing of the guard. That a new adventurous beginning. Huh. Okay. Oh, yeah. We're seeing new beginnings coming through, too, in, in many areas here. Okay. I see. You need to kind of let your guard down in some areas. Okay. You could be a little bit overly cautious. All right. I see that you're still dealing with some kind of still. So maybe did I say that last week because I said still with some jealousy around you. OK, that's between you and others or other or others around you. It's just surrounding you. So I'm seeing that energy. I see there is a hope, a big, strong desire for something. OK, it's really showing up. I do see a turn of events. OK, and then with that, I do see that you may get very serious, very quiet or you may start checking things out. There's a sense of investigating, checking things through thoroughly, okay? I'm seeing that too, or analyzing some certain situations in your life, okay? I am also seeing you could be dealing with somebody or someone who's very interested in you too. Um, you could be being watched, okay? That's another way I'm seeing this too. For some, and it is a general reason, uh, reading, this could be like, you know, being investigated, Someone could be actually invading your privacy somehow. So watch, make sure you get your passwords, your um, on, com on your computer and your accounts changed. You know, that's another way I'm seeing this as well. Okay, there's something about secrecy around as well. Okay, so I'm seeing that too. I do see um, making affirmations. You could really bring out some deep desires and wishes. Okay, so that's kind of um very strong here i do see there is spiritual support as well i see matters of the heart okay and something really strong in your heart something that's like a really deep desire for some of you you may be uh, connecting with a friend that you had in the past this could be a best friend that you had or you may start becoming very close to someone and you deem them as your best friend, okay? You become best friends, BFFs, okay? I'm seeing that energy too. So I'm seeing money is um, showing up too. It's very good. There's money on the horizon. Money is showing up. Um, persevering, okay? I see that you're very strong, very persevering. You got the strength this week to get through a lot. I do see certain situations of people leaving your life, okay? And that's going to clear up a lot because then I see success and victory coming through. So that is good. I do see that there is success and victory um, coming through very, uh, very strongly, especially when there's a change of perspective too and cutting and editing or some situations just leaving. So that is looking really strong and good there. Um, your intuition is as good as anything this week, okay? It always is, but you know what? Use it as a compass, all right? Um, you can tell exactly where you're heading for good or for bad. You know that. But you won't be able to exactly express yourself. You're holding a lot to yourself. So that's what I think I've been seeing too. Um, articulating it to anyone else is going to be kind of hard, okay? Um, for some reason. You're going to need to draw on your intuition again to connect with um, others on a deeper level. It's like just knowing how to do it. You know, just kind of be able to read someone and connect to someone on a deeper lo a level too. Um, but I do see some people or situations around you are kind of superficial and frustrating too. It's like you want this deeper level, but it's all kind of superficial, frustrating, something like this. Now, this could be with work. This could be with school. This could be with um, a certain area in your life. Um, this could be a, like a school teacher, a boss, um, or someone who's like deems authority of you. Could um it's kind of erratic or a little bit crazy. So <laughs> try to just keep your head down this week, okay, with that. It's like you can't do anything about it. It's just a passing phase, you know, just the mood or energy. Um, 
there's a lot of things coming through that are pretty good. Great things are, um, are going to be awaiting you, especially, I think, maybe coming into the weekend and that. So, okay, interesting. Now, on the plate, exactly. <laughs> very sensitive energy, too. Very fluid. Fluid energy, too. So, that can also say, um, some of you could be around water or dealing with water because it's very watery. Um, I do see there's a lot of thoughts of future coming through, okay? Just um, a lot of thoughts that could be coming through, but make sure everything's realistic, I guess, all right? There's a um, very new beginning coming through, too. Also, you're attracting people again. For some of you, there is a recovery period, and also you may be taking um, like a spontaneous, there's a sense of spontaneity where you just may say, you know what, I'm just going to take off of work, I'm taking a break. I'm going vacation. I'm seeing that as well. Okay. So that's coming through too. Watch your health and well-being. That means your um your mental, emotional, and physical health is showing up as well. I do see um be careful of promises made or um you promising anything because the follow through, you know, say no if you mean no, say yes if you mean yes, that kind of energy. A lot of emotional deep energy is coming through too here. Um I do see you will do something that's going to um, you're going to do something or you're going to I don't know either help someone out or just something is you're going to have an influence over someone else okay and that person's going to be you're going to make that person very happy somehow that's one thing I'm seeing too um, I just see some energy here that's you kind of, it's like things are a drag. You kind of want to change things. There's this un a, a restlessness within you. I do see also, it's like, look, you're just going to, uh, towards a new beginning adventure. It's like some of you are just going to um, take a risk or something. It's like going off the beaten path too. So it's quite interesting. <laughs> okay. What I wanted to say is, um, yes, I will be doing the monthly readings. I'll be posting them on Tuesday evening, so check. Um, you can look out for those. I don't do private readings on Saturday and Sundays, and I will not be booking any private readings this coming Monday either. I'll be off. So any readings that do come in, I'll be um, scheduling them from Tuesday on. And you can always check my website. I always have updates there, too, and discounts and other things there always going on. Um, otherwise, this was a reading for the week of May 27th through June 2nd. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I will catch you back next week for your next reading. Until then, all the best, and bye for now.